by the U.S. Navy to keep one step ahead. The world's first squadron of hydrofoil ships was recently commissioned and based in Key West. The six vessels, each one 130 feet in length, are under the command of this man, Captain Frank Horn. As Commodore of this squadron, Captain Horn is a firm believer in the newfound abilities of a ship that can fly above the waves. Two things make these hydrofoils, with their uh, fully submerged foils, better than the standard ship. First is obviously their speed. Secondly, they are very stable platforms in heavy seas, which means that they are able to fire their weapons when most conventional hulls would have a difficult time firing their weapons because of the instability. The point in the Caribbean within a matter of hours and are the choice boats for that everyone seems to agree on. Even Captain Horn puts it in two simple words. Exciting. And it's the only way to fly. Exactly how fast these ships will go, we can't say. The Navy says somewhere over 40 knots, but exactly how far over is classified information. Their speed and maneuverability make these ships perfect for blockades, convoy escorts, and surveillance, which is why they were stationed in Key West. They can get to any point in the Caribbean within a matter of hours and are the choice boats for patrolling the Florida Straits. The Danish captain seems impressed with it so far. Navigation in these waters can sometimes be tricky, especially when you're traveling at these speeds. So, besides the standard method of taking visual bearings and plotting a course as they go, these sailors have developed a new system exclusively for the hydrofoil squadron. It uses a television camera and a monitor to superimpose their own radar image right onto a chart of the area waters. The white spot near the center is their ship, so the navigator is looking at a picture of his own ship in relation to everything else in the area, all on one TV screen. The weapons on board include eight Harpoon cruise missiles and a rapid-fire 76mm naval gun. I think the captain from Denmark is sold. I think they are marvelous ships, and I would wish that we had uh, some of those too. Okay.